Hi, I'm Cassie with Me Time. Let's talk about how to assemble buildings for your collectible Christmas holiday village. The first thing we're going to do is stitch the front and the back pieces together. If you remember right, when we stitched them at the beginning, we used a visible thread. This is where it's important. If you look, there are two stitches here visible with that green thread. The first one here is the tack down line for the shape form. The second one right next to it right here is our stitch line. And that is what we're going to sew on to make sure that we assemble our church correctly. Now that we have stitched our stitch lines, the front and the back are together and we can remove our clips that we use to hold them in place. After we've sewn our two pieces together, it's time to turn the building. First things first, you put your hands on both sides and kind of give it a little bit of a pop to create some space in between. Then you take a point. It doesn't matter which point you use, it can be either one, but you put the point through first. And kind of take it as far as you can. And then you take the next point and take it as far as you can. Now remember shape form is able to be moved all about and then ironed back nice and flat. So this is a totally safe process. And there you go. At this point, it's time to glue the roof onto the walls of your building. We're gonna use whichever glue that you prefer and just put a generous amount along the edges. Now remember that each glue has its own drying time. And before you start gluing your roof, you should make sure you know how long you're going to need to stay there and hold it before you go anywhere else. You don't want to let go and have your roof pop and not stay nice and pretty. So after we have our edges glued, we're gonna take our roof. So it's important to remember when we're putting the roof on that this fold that's on top needs to be at the front of the building so that we don't see this little gap and that the one underneath is toward the back. So we're gonna take it and we're going to line up our peaks Just like that. And then we're going to set it nice and flat and hold it until the glue is sufficiently dry. The next piece to glue is the top of the steeple roof to the walls. So again, add your glue. And then we're going to line up the seams. Both of these pieces had a seam that we stitched, so we're gonna make sure that those seams are lined up. So that seam matches this seam. And then we're going to place our roof on top and wiggle it into place, being careful not to squish this, because remember, it's just glitter and chiffon. And then when we're satisfied, we're gonna hang on to it until the glue is sufficiently set. All right, the next piece to glue is the church walls to the roof of the church. So again, apply your glue of choice all around the edges. And then just like before, we're gonna need to hold it until the glue is sufficiently set. So we like to make sure that the seams are in the back just so that they're not visible and then center your walls on your church and hold it in place until it's dry.